hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is Tari Karimba thank you so much for tuning in today's video so in today's video we are going to be talking about forgiving yourself I feel like there's so much emphasis that is put on forgiving other people and living a life of forgiveness and all of that good stuff but no one ever talks about the fact that it's so important for you to also live a life of forgiving yourself so in this video I'm gonna share a few tips that I have you know come to learn and realize when it comes to self-forgiveness and I hope that this is useful for you thank you for tuning in remember to comment like and subscribe so the first thing that I find to be extremely extremely important is to take responsibility for what happened or what you did to yourself it is extremely important for you to take responsibility because in so doing you are acknowledging what you did wrong and the fact that you did do something wrong to yourself in the same way if you wanted to forgive someone you would obviously want them to acknowledge what they did and acknowledge that it was wrong so you need to apply that same principle to yourself so after you've accepted that okay yeah i take responsibility for this i did wrong you know i wasn't supposed to do this or i let myself down you now need to go to the next step and look at what led you to act in that way okay so maybe you told yourself that you are never going to settle ever again whether it's in a friendship relationship whatever and then you do do that you've let yourself down you've done this thing that you said you were going you were not going to do so look at everything behind that why did you behave in that way what is the situation that led to these things happening okay i feel like that is so important to look at because then you can get down to the bottom of your behavior and also make sure that next time you don't do the same thing again so during this process make sure you are completely honest with yourself so once you've done that the next thing that you need to do is look at ways that you can avoid behaving in that way again okay so look at the behavior that led you to do that you know what can you do differently next time to make sure that you don't let yourself down or you don't hurt yourself or put yourself in a position that is unfavorable we don't always have control of certain things in life but i feel like in situations where you have to forgive yourself it's like okay i you know let myself get into this situation or i stayed in this situation or you know whatever it is so you really need to look at the behavior why it happened and then establish a plan of healing or just coming up with a better game plan in the future to make sure that you don't let yourself down so the next thing that you need to do is apologize to yourself okay so whether you're gonna write that down or you know sit in front of a mirror and talk to yourself you need to apologize to yourself for letting yourself down it's so so important for you to do this because the truth is if someone else had done you wrong Wrong, you would want them to apologize so in the same way you need to apologize to yourself so the next thing that you need to do is to remember that you're only human okay be gentle with yourself be kind to yourself even in those moments when you feel absolutely disappointed it's okay that it happened it's okay that you let yourself down it's okay that that is the situation it happens we all have times when we mess up and that's okay so once you realize that I feel like that really helps you to learn to be kinder to yourself so the next thing you need to do is tell yourself that i forgive you okay so for example if i wrong myself i will say to myself you know what teddy i hate what you did but i forgive you <laughs> i feel like it's so important it's such an important part of the healing process to hear those words especially from you to you so don't forget to tell yourself that you forgive yourself and the last thing is of course to stop dwelling on things that you can't change realize that i've already done this it's already in the past no amount of crying stressing over it overthinking all of that is going to change anything so accept that okay it happened i can't change it but now i have to move on because no matter how much you dwell on what happened or think about it and all of that all of your dwelling and thinking about it is not going to go back and change what happened so yeah guys those are the tips that i have for you that you can apply to your life whenever you need to forgive yourself and i think the most important thing i would say is just to remember that you are human you do mess up but it's not the end of the world the fact that you're still waking up every morning and breathing means that there's still a tomorrow and a today to be lived and as long as you still have that opportunity it's a fresh start every new day is a first start every new day is a new opportunity and you know in the word it actually says his mercies are new every morning so your mercies to yourself should also be new every morning forgive yourself and you're human 
and you're doing the best that you can so yeah i hope you guys found this useful remember to comment like and subscribe i'll catch you in the next one